gathering here from all of Europe and we are like like we are the, the future of Europe. We are representing the future of the European Union. So we are what the, the European Union was founded for. Yeah, the motto of History Campus is uh, look back, think forward. Look, uh, think back, look forward, oh, right? The motto of the History Campus is look back, think forward. Look back, think forward. We are playing theatre, so the workshop's called uh, Express Yourself, so it's a lot about improvisational theatre. So we're making a lot of different activities. In my workshop I experienced, I think, this kind of diversity that I, for example, work with a girl from Bosnia, and it's very exciting because that's actually where the First World War started in Sarajevo. So this is quite interesting to see the different kind of points of view. I would say the most important reason why we should talk about World War One is because it is such a big part of our identity, so, um, of our personal identity, of our identity as a German or as a Italian or as a French or as someone from Europe or from another part of the world. It is part of our European identity as well. My name is Milan Botanfer, I'm from Hungary and I'm taking part in the peace renegotiation workshop. Yeah, it's quite complicated. We can say we are renegotiating the pieces made in, made at the end of the World War One in hundred years ago, right now. And we are like I'm, for example, I can show you. I'm Mr. Winston Churchill or Sir Winston Winston Churchill. For example, I'm from Great Britain right now, and I have to play the role of the Great Britain. I'm in the comic workshop, and we did uh, comics uh, on the topic of uh, colonial soldiers in the First World War. I mean, it's interesting to like every day you meet like uh, ten new people and uh, you know, speak with them, uh, get to know where they're from, and uh, it's uh, yeah, it's really exciting. My name is Tina. I'm 23. And I'm from Greece. And my workshop is uh, called uh, Gaming the War, and it has we have to create a game concerning the First World War, and we're using the program Unity. Obviously history is about diversity, but especially um, learning about history should be about diversity as well. So in Germany, for example, people should not only learn the German perspective of World War I history, they should also include like, in school, for example, um, perspectives from different countries. So we should work transnationally on this, on this historical topic. And this is something about diversity, this is something about tolerance as well, something about understanding.